Greetings from Gotcha Ghost. This is Joe Campbell, and uh, this is my number one ghost box that I made, an uh, experimental device. Um, made out of a wood cabinet made by me. All the electronics, everything else installed. Uh, it's got some nice wood grain on the side there. Uh, single battery pack operation takes six AA batteries. And the way you work it is you just turn it on. There's a little switch under there. Everything should turn on. If it doesn't, there are on and off switches to make sure everything's turned on for the different units. Uh, up here, and I still need to label these. I didn't label them yet. This here is the amplifier, and it's on, off, and volume. This here is a tone control for the amplifier, and I'll put uh, labels on those. I forgot to. There's a few extra holes in there that were from... Uh, experimenting but I just kind of left them because uh, there's not much you can do. Optional antenna you can pull the antenna out if you want to localize your signal. Okay so the radio power here and this is the sweep speed all the way to the left is the fast is fast and then if you turn it towards the right it slows down the sweep speed. It's very sensitive I like it a little on the fast side this is the uh, noise reduction section, on off switch, hard soft switch, I keep it up on hard, and the threshold, which is uh, how much noise you wanna reduce. Turning it to the left will let most everything come through. Turning it to the right will cut out some of that noise. Although it's not too noisy anyway. Hello, I heard you. You're back, huh? A friend of mine likes to come in and say hello sometimes. It's you? Yes, I know. How are you? I'm sorry I missed that. How are you doing? Oh, yeah? Yeah, it's very interesting. I'm just showing how the box works. So, uh, yeah, well, well, I'm going to make another one, so don't worry about it. This here is the reverberation control, reverb. Kind of helps shape the sound. There's a mix button. I like it kind of close to all the way up. And then a dwell button, at, or knob I should say, not button. The dwell decides how long the sound will ring out for. All the way on and uh, it will echo for a long period of time. So I like to keep it about halfway or so. And the on-off switch for that. There's an extra hole there, but we'll just use that as a breather in here. <laughs> so anyway, uh, it works pretty good for me. Uh, it's not the greatest sound, but uh, it's definitely made with a lot of love and a lot of uh, belief and understanding. And I'm hoping that it goes to the right person because I'm ready to make another one. I'd like this to get out to somebody who really wants it. So about 500 bucks plus shipping, and that'll allow me to make some more of these. And that's about it. Thanks very much for watching.